So they said to me, we think you're going to be great for the job. You've got the skills, you've got the experience, but most importantly, you've got the passion. Somewhere I read of the freedom of press. I said to them, I know I've got the skills, I've definitely got the passion, but more importantly, I have worked in a host of sectors. I've got the experience as well. But when did that come in? When do you think that started from, from my days as it was fisticuffs? You know, you're going you're gonna to get into a little fight with someone. It's, little, yeah. it's, it's physical, it's flesh on f flesh. Yeah. At what point did someone say, do you know what? I'm taking this pole, I'm taking the hammer, now I'm taking a knife, now I'm actually finding a gun. Um, I think it just, as, as things were made readily accessible, like for example, in my area, there was a shop that's closed down now. Um, I can't remember, G something, I can't remember the name of it, but mm -hmm. yeah, everyone just used to go there. Historically, you are from a colony of gypsies who have settled here over the last 45 years. You found this unauthorised land, as they call it, because it's, it's, the government hasn't given you. You've claimed, you claimed the land 45 years ago, and then suddenly someone from the government, what, turns up, knocks at your, 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 your door or goes to the colony and says, we, we want to break it down. Talk to me about that conversation when you first heard that the colony was going to be demolished and what that sent through the whole colony once they heard that. At some point, though, you grew up and you mm. decided Newcastle wasn't for you mm. and you got on a coach. I did, the non-stop clipper. Tell me about it, because it literally it was, you decided, I want to go. Yeah, I'd, well, I'd wanted to, I knew I wanted to leave mm -hmm. the, the, the North East. It's, Why? It was, because everyone knows your business, Trevor. <laughs> you know, they know your business in London, no, but it's <laughs> So in this world of Brexit, Trump, Brexit, Obama leaving, Brexit, potential breaking up of the union, Brexit, I've still got my sanity. And I'm pretty healthy as well, I swim and I run, I love going around my friends' houses for food because I love good food, but most importantly, I know how to party hard. But when it comes to work, I know what I've got to do. I am committed. I am willing to put in the hours, whatever it takes, to make sure that what I present is of a high standard. So they said to me,